Hey guys, it's Gabrielle Simone and welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, groove. Baby girl, watch how you move. I got them vests on my shoes. I'm up a pill and I lose. Wait, speed it up. Look at the diamonds, they eat it up. Every two bitches, I beat it up. On today's video, we are going to be reviewing some Tree Hut scrubs. They came out with a new collection this past couple of weeks i believe so i went ahead and purchased some and i wanted to do a review for you guys so if you guys want to see that just keep on watching i have been super excited to film this video because if there's one thing y'all need to know about me i love hygiene like anything hygiene like body washes scrubs anything like that i just love them so i thought i would go ahead and purchase all of these scrubs and review them for you guys i went ahead and ordered this on march 21st and it came super quick it ended up coming on march 26th but it's finally time to open up the box so let's get into it Okay, so I went ahead and ordered all eight of the scrubs and I also ordered another one that wasn't in the new collection that they had, but I needed it. So I'm going to go ahead and review that one as well. This is what the box looks like. It's a huge box with like should be 10 items in here. I'm just hoping that these scrubs didn't melt or anything like that because it's been sitting in my room for almost a week and the temperature here has been very crazy. So hopefully they're all intact and we'll see when I open the box. So we're going to go ahead and open the box. Oh my gosh. I've been waiting to open this box for so long. Okay, so in the box it came with this little paper of everything that I ordered and then this little thing on top. And this is what the box looks like. I don't, the sun's shining very, very bright, but this is what it looks like on the inside. Okay, so to start, I'm gonna start with the one that I told you guys wasn't in the collection and that one is the Bohemian Escape Scrub. Some of the scrubs have like a little wrapping on them, I guess to keep them safe, so that's good because packaging is A1. But this is the Bohemian Escape Scrub and this one wasn't in the new collection that came out. I just wanted this one because it has turmeric in it and this helps like lighten skin and make your skin even and I really needed this. So I heard really good things about it, so I thought I would go ahead and purchase it. And before I open it, this is what it says on the lid. It says the Bohemian Escape Shea Sugar Scrub. And it says turmeric and it exfoliates and tones the skin. So let's go ahead and open it. This is what it looks like on the inside. It's not melty or anything. Like I said, I kept it in my room, but it's still intact. And let's go ahead and smell it. This smells... This actually smells really good. Like, I wasn't expecting it to smell. It doesn't smell citrusy, but it smells a little citrusy. Like, it reminds me of, like, a fruit. And it also doesn't smell like turmeric at all. Like, if you were to go ahead and get, like, turmeric from, like, your cabinet or something like that, it would not smell anything like that. Like, it doesn't smell powdery or anything like that. It smells, like, kind of like summer or, like, a lotion you would get from Ulta or something like that. Like, it smells really good. And I'm super excited to use this. Oh, my gosh. I'm not really sure how to describe this other than like citrusy, but not like citrusy, not like sour or anything like that. It smells like fruity, like a fruity citrus, but this smells really good. I have like the perfect scent in my head, but I don't know what it is. It just kind of reminds me of something that I had when I was younger, but it just smells so good. I highly recommend this. It smells so good. Gosh, Tree Hut literally does their thing. Like I don't even know how to like describe them. I love them 100% over doves, just these they just hit it different so that one is the bohemian escape okay so now for the ones that i did order that were all in the collection i think i'm gonna go ahead and do scrub and then the body butters that i got not all of them that they came out with came with a whipped butter but i'm gonna go ahead and do the ones that did come with the whipped butter first okay so i'm not really sure which one i'm like the most excited about but one of the ones that i wanted to smell first is the watermelon one because that's the one that everyone was hyped about so i think i'm gonna go ahead and smell that one first so this is what the watermelon one looks like. It literally looks like watermelon. This is the packaging, that's the top of it. So it says the watermelon shea sugar scrub for hydrated, youthful looking skin made with shea butter, watermelon, and vegan collagen. Collagen. I'm not sure how to say that, so correct me if I'm wrong. But um, this is what it looks like. Super cute packaging, looks exactly like watermelon. They even perfected like all the seeds that they had in it. And I just think this is super cute. So let's go ahead and open it and smell it. Everyone says that this smells exactly like watermelon. So I'm super excited to see what it smells like. This is what it looks like. Okay, so. Okay, so it's not 
as strong as I thought it was going to be. It's definitely more of like a faint watermelon smell, but it definitely does still smell really good. Just like very faint. I don't know if it's just my watermelon scrub, but everyone else has a, their smells straight like watermelon and it does, but it's not, it's not really so strong. This kind of smells like very faint and it's not overpowering at all. It kind of smells like a fake perfume, to be honest. Like it doesn't smell like, and not that it was like cheaply made or anything like that. It just kind of smells very, just very faint. That's really all I can describe it as. It smells like watermelon, but just not what I expected it to be. So I'm not disappointed, but I'm not, I'm not as excited as I thought I was going to be. But it definitely still smells really good. And it might come off different when I put it on my body. Maybe it's just faint in the bottle, but I feel like when I put it on, it might come off more stronger. So this is what the watermelon whipped butter looks like and it just says watermelon whipped shade a body butter for hydrated youthful looking skin same thing as the other one so almost basically the same packaging so let's go ahead and smell this one um i'm not really sure if it's gonna smell more empowering than that one or less but i feel like since it's a body butter it probably will smell just a little bit more empowering okay this one definitely has more of a watermelon scent it's more you can smell it more in this one than you can in that one, but I definitely feel like if you put these two together, you'll smell amazing. It smells good, but it still smells like a fake perfume, sort of. I feel like everyone else, everyone else videos that you may have watched, I feel like they're going to be like, oh yeah, this smells like super good. Like it smells good, don't get me wrong, but it just smells fake a little bit. But it's it smells good. It just smells kind of like a Victoria's Secret, kind of like a Victoria's Secret perfume versus like, a perfume we would get at like Macy's or something like that if that makes any kind of sense it's just I wish the smell was a little bit more more there if that makes sense okay so now let's go ahead and move on to a new one the next one that I think I want to go ahead and try is the lavender one because that one also has a matching body butter so this one also came with a wrapping on it and the packaging is honestly very very good love that because one thing about me is my packages have to come like they were prepare nicely like I don't like packages that were just kind of thrown in and given to me that's just no but that's not what this video is about so we're on this one this one looks super pretty and purple is my favorite color and this just looks so vibrant and so pretty just love the way that this looks but on the top it says the lavender shea sugar scrub it helps calm senses and smooths the skin it's made with shea butter lavender and vanilla so I am super excited to try this out and let's see how it goes. That's what it looks like. Okay. This one doesn't smell like lavender at all to me. This smells like mint. This, I wasn't expecting this. This one definitely smells like, like mint peppermint or something. This smells like minty. Like I can definitely smell like a hint of lavender, but it definitely smells more like minty. Like it has a more overpowering mint smell than it does lavender. And I don't smell any vanilla either. This one, it still smells really good. Like I actually really do like the smell of this. It's very light, but it's not too light. Like it's not overpowering, but it's not too light. It's like right in the middle. This smells, this actually smells really good, but it doesn't really smell like lavender. It smells more like minty. And it smells really fresh. Like, do you guys know those little like, like mint leaves that you cook with? That's what it smells like. So let's go ahead and review the lavender whipped butter. So it has the same thing. It helps calm and soothe the skin. And it has basically the same packaging. Looks like that. So let's go ahead and open it up. This is what it looks like on the inside. Now this doesn't really have much of a smell. It's definitely lighter than the scrub, but it's definitely not, like that scent is still there. Um, I feel like together it might bring more of that scent out, but I'm not really sure. I'm not really smelling the lavender, honestly. I don't know, maybe I just don't know what lavender smells like, but this, this isn't what I expected, but it's not bad. It still smells really good, but it's not, it just, it smells like a whipped butter, honestly. That's all I can really say about it. It's not bad, but it's not what I expected. I feel like you guys and me and myself was expecting something like totally different, but I feel like a lot of these reviews aren't really telling you guys the truth. Like I feel like they're just kind of telling you guys, oh, it smells good, it smells like what it says. 
but to me personally they don't really smell like i hoped that they would be okay so the next one that i want to go ahead and show you guys that also has a matching whipped butter is the tropic glow and this is what it looks like that's what the top looks like it's a little bit different packaging from like the lavender one or let's say the watermelon one it definitely has different packaging and i mean i like the packaging it looks good this one is the tropic glow firming sugar scrub it's made with shea butter i don't even know how to say that but it says I don't, i'll put it on the screen but i don't know what that says something butter pistachio and guarana extracts i don't know i'll put that one on the screen too but i don't know what that says but that's what's made with but this is what it looks like and i actually heard really good reviews about this one too um people said that it smells not like what they expected but it smells really good it smells like summer like it smells different from the rest of the line that they have so let's go ahead and open it that's what it looks like so let's go ahead and test it out i'm really excited to smell this one this one smells good oh my gosh oh my gosh this smells good oh my gosh i wish i could like describe this but like i literally can't it smells it smells so good like do you know it smells like when like you're walking down the hallway and like that one girl who always smells good walks past you that's what this smells like like it smells it just smells powerful like it smells so I can't stop smelling it. It smells so good. Oh my gosh. Oh, that smells so good. You, this one you guys need. This one smells, this one smells amazing. And it has a matching body butter. Oh yes. This one, this one smells good. This one's the most powerful scent out of all the other ones that I smell. This one's the most powerful scent. This smells so good. It smells like spring, it smells like summer. I would say more summer than spring because it's more powerful, but this one smells so good and I cannot wait to put this on. So let's go ahead and review the body butter and hopefully it smells the exact same. Okay, so this is the body butter and it has the same top, obviously, just like all the other ones. So let's go ahead and smell it. So this is what it looks like as you open it. That's what it looks like. Ah, oh, that smells so good. This one, this one smells obviously more like a body butter, so it's not going to be as scented as the other one, but it smells almost exactly like powering as the other one. This smells so good. If Tree Hut had perfumes, oh my gosh, they would be sold out every single day. Like you wouldn't be able to find anything. You wouldn't be able to order online, get it in stores. That's what they should do is make some perfumes because every girl would be smelling amazing if they try the scrubs with the body butters with a perfume please oh my gosh everybody would be walking around smelling delicious oh my gosh i can't get over this this one i think this one out of all the others i tried are my favorite this one and the bohemian escape one are my favorites so far okay so i have three scrubs left i'm not sure which one i want to try i have the green tea the papaya paradise and the sugared fantasy so I'm actually really excited about the green tea and the papaya paradise, but I don't want to get my hopes up. So the one I'm going to go ahead and try is the sugared fantasy. Came like this. This is what it looks like. This color is so pretty. I was actually not going to buy this one because I tried the sugared frosted cookie or the frosted sugar cookie one. And it just smelled like a burnt candle to me. Like I didn't really like it. And especially like after I got out of the shower and it like really sunk into my skin, I just didn't really like it. It just really just smelled like a burnt out candle. So. I was kind of skeptical of the Sugared Fantasy one, but I bought it anyway because I wanted to buy the whole collection. So if I don't use it, I'll just give it to my sister or like my mom. But this is what it looks like. The color is super pretty. And this is the reason why I actually got it because the color just stuck out to me. And it just says Sugared Fantasy Shea Sugar Scrub. It doesn't say like it does anything on the bottom like the other ones do, but that's all it is. So let's go ahead and open it and see what it smells like. I don't really know what to expect out of this one. Like, I don't know to expect something sweet or like something lightweight. Like, I'm not really sure. But let's go ahead and open it and find out. So this is what it looks like when you open it. Very, very pretty color. Okay, this one smells good. This one kind of smells like a hair conditioner. Like, very fresh and very like, it reminds me kind of like the ocean, like beach vibes. That's honestly what it gives me this smells good this one would have been great with a whipped body butter oh my gosh 
they should definitely make a whipped body butter for this one. This one smells really good. Like it reminds me of like the ocean and like gives me your like summer vibes, like going on a trip or something like that. This smells really, really good. I was, I'm surprised by this one. This one smells good. Oh my gosh. This one smells like hair conditioner. Like, do you guys know? No, it smells like the, I don't know the name of the brand, but I'm going to insert a picture. Or it smells like, I think it's the Argan Oil brand or like the Morocco the morocco brand i don't know but the blue bottle or something like that it smells like the hair conditioner and this smells so good like it doesn't smell like bad like like bad hair conditioner it just smells like it smells like a scrub but hair conditioner like i don't really know how to explain it but it smells so good so fresh so clean like this one i think would match really really well with the body wash from dove like the plain body wash with like the blue lid i'll insert a picture of that one as well because that one has like no scent at all so like anything you pair it with will like stick onto your skin i think that one will work really good with this one this one smells really good and i am so happy about this one okay so we're down to the last two scrubs so i think i'm gonna save the papaya paradise for last and i think i'm gonna go ahead and review the green tea one so this is what the green tea one looks like and I'm kind of skeptical about this one because I don't like tea. Like, I hate tea. Like, I just don't like it. And I don't like the smell of it. And I don't like the smell of green tea specifically. So I'm kind of skeptical about this one. But I went ahead and bought it anyways. So it says, do green tea, shea sugar scrub, and it purifies and balances the skin. And it's made with shea butter, antioxidants, green tea, and goji berry. So this is what the top looks like. And this is what it looks like. 360. So let's go ahead and open it. So this is what it looks like as you open it. This looks like that. I'm kind of scared to smell it because I don't want it to smell like green tea. But everyone says it doesn't smell like green tea. But I just, I don't know. So let's go ahead and smell it. It, it doesn't smell like green tea at all. Okay. This, I feel like this is going to sound very, very strange. But like this reminds me of a time when I used to play Mario Kart like I, I feel like that sounds so dumb but like this is what like these are the vibes i'm getting and i just i just like this smells like outside like this smells very fresh very clean like like very lightweight it just smells like 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 just perfect like honestly that's really all i can say and it doesn't i'm getting like the slightest like cucumber vibes but like not cucumber if that makes sense it just smells very fresh, like very spring, like because it's springtime now. And this smells like the perfect thing to be wearing right now. This smells good. And it doesn't smell like green tea at all. Like doesn't smell like the tea itself. This smells good. I'm very surprised with this one. Okay, so the last one that we have is the Papaya Paradise. And this is what it looks like. This one says the Papaya Paradise Shea Sugar Scrub made with shea butter, papaya extract, and pineapple enzymes but this one looks like this one's packaging also is kind of different from like the usual ones like it's this one and the tropic glow that kind of have different packaging from like the rest of them but i actually think this looks, this one looks really cute so let's go ahead and open this one this is what it looks like as you open it looks like that these are very thick scrubs as well which is what i love about them so let's go ahead and smell it This one smells good. I definitely smell the pineapple. I don't know what a papaya smells like, so I can't really give you guys an honest review on that side of the spectrum, but this smells really good. I definitely smell the pineapple and I love pineapples, but this is what it looks like. It's very thick and I love that. Like it doesn't move when like I do this. This smells very good. This definitely gives me like summer vibes. Like kind of like driving down the coast kind of vibes i feel like the, like my comparisons really make no sense but this gives me like vacation vibes like this just smells very fruity and citrusy like this one kind of reminds me of this one kind of reminds me of this one a little bit yeah these two kind of smell the same these two kind of smell a little bit alike but this one smells more fruity and more citrusy than this one this one has more of like a musky kind of smell slightly but this one smells more like fresh more kind of on the girly side i guess you could say but it smells very good like this one has to also be one of my favorites as well if this one had a matching body butter this would be sold out 
all the time. Like I know there are still some rare scrubs that like nobody can find. Like it's not on the website. It's not in stores. It's kind of like just the deep black web or something like that. But this one smells really good and I wish it had a perfume or a body wash or a lotion or a whipped body butter with it because this one smells really, really good. Okay, so that was all of these scrubs that I had to show you guys. So I kind of just have them sitting right next to me. So now, before we go ahead and close out this video, I'm gonna go ahead and rate all of the scrubs that I showed you guys. Okay, so starting with this one, I would definitely have to give this one out of a 10. I'm gonna have to give this one a five and a half. I'm gonna give it a five and a half because it doesn't necessarily smell like watermelon, but it doesn't not smell like watermelon. But it's just not the scent that I was expecting out of it. It smells good, really, really good. And also the whipped body butter smells amazing as well, but it's not what I expected. It's just kind of faint and it just kind of smells fake to me. Like it's not like a bad kind of fake, but just not what I was expecting for a watermelon one. And compared to like everybody else's reviews, mine's probably one of the lowest, but I would definitely give this one maybe a 5.5, maybe a six, but it's not what I expected, but not disappointed. And for the whipped body butter, I would probably give this one a six and a half because it smells better than the scrub in my opinion. Okay, so the next one that I went ahead and reviewed was the lavender ones. So this one, it smells more like mint, like I said. I'm not really getting lavender. Well, see, now I'm getting a little bit of lavender, but I'm definitely getting like mint. Like it kind of smells like when you first walk into Whole Foods. But I definitely do really like the smell of this. So I'm gonna go ahead and give this one a seven. It's not my favorite, but it's not my least favorite. And as well as the body butter, I'll go ahead and give it a seven as well. Okay, so the next one that I reviewed was the Tropic Glow. I love the smell of this. This one smells so good, like I can't get over this. I will go ahead and give both of these a 10. Like there's there's nothing more really to say. This is a 10 out of 10. And also I forgot to tell you guys about the Bohemian Escape, even though this one isn't a part of the collection. This one is a 10 out of 10 as well. It smells super good and I'm just, I love this one. This one smells really good. All right, so the next one is the Sugar Fantasy. I'm gonna go ahead and give this a nine out of 10. This one smells really good, but I feel like I need coffee beans right now because there's so much going on in my nose. But I'm gonna go ahead and give this a nine out of 10. It's not my favorite, but it's nowhere near my least favorite. I love this one. It smells really good, but not a 10 out of 10. The next one that I had was a green tea and I'm gonna go ahead and give this one, I'm gonna give this one an eight because it smells really good, it smells very fresh but it's not necessarily my favorite one, but it does smell really, really, really good. And I highly recommend you get, honestly, all of these scrubs. And last but not least, we have the Papaya Paradise. And for this one, it's a 10 out of 10. No questions asked, 10 out of 10. Smells so good, super citrusy, smells fruity, smells like candy, smells edible. Like this literally makes me wanna eat it. It smells so good. And I highly, highly, highly recommend you get these scrubs. Okay guys, so that is the end of today's Tree Hut haul on the new scrubs that they had on their new collection. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to leave a big thumbs up. Let me know down below if you do have these scrubs, your favorite scent and why it's your favorite scent. Let me know your least favorite scent as well because I wanna know why that is your least favorite as well. Also, if you liked the video, don't forget to go ahead and subscribe. We would love to have you join the family and I would love to have you here. But that is all for today's video and I will see you guys very, very soon in my next video. Bye guys.